Swiggity Swag, what's in the bag? Jay here bringing you guys the final episode of our Pokemon Sun Gold Egglock. I hope you guys have enjoyed this series. If you guys did, don't forget to hit the like button down below to show your support for the finale. Let's see if we can reach 300 likes. On the previous episodes, uh, we haven't been able to reach the like goal, but let's see if we can do that for this final episode, you guys. But... I need to tell you guys a few things before we jump into this episode uh, because uh, <laughs> there's a lot of stuff that I have to say. So, um, first of all, yes, there will be an egg hatching stream. I know people are, have been wondering, you know, Jay, are you going to be hatching all of the eggs? Are you going to be doing a stream? Where's the stream going to be at? We want information about this, Jay. Yes, there will be an egg hatching stream tomorrow at 3 p.m. EST here on youtube after this video goes up i will schedule the live stream for you guys and that way you guys will know just when the live stream will start and then you know i will hatch all the eggs tomorrow and you know we'll all just have a really fun good time and all that good stuff but yes there will be an egg hatching stream second of all I want to thank you guys so much for the support on this series. A lot of you guys said that this is your favorite series. A lot of people said that they love this series even though, you know, I am screaming at the game because of the outrageous type chart that this game goes by. You know, you guys said that you guys and you guys enjoy the series. So, thank you guys so much for the support on this series. Thank you guys so much for uh, you know, just being here watching the uh, watching the video or you know, sending in an egg. Thank you guys so much for sending in all your eggs and stuff as well. I'm sorry that I couldn't hatch them all uh honestly i think this game like heart gold soul silver sacred gold storm silver sun gold moon silver i think you know just generation two itself is like like the best uh, the best generation to uh do an egg lock in because you can hatch so many eggs because there's two regions so many routes so many areas and that's that's why i did this so um you know again thank you guys so much for the support and all that stuff so one final thing and this is the really important thing <laughs> and this is because i screwed up big time so if you guys uh follow me on twitter and you guys were on twitter earlier today i tweeted out uh that i had already recorded this episode and i ended up using a dead pokemon so and i didn't find out until i after the episode was finished and i went to go edit the episode so <laughs> Oh, it's great. It's great. It's great. Okay, so I started recording the episode, right? And I was using Friend, the Ampharos. Now, if you guys remember, Friend died against, I think, Lance. So Friend was dead, but I ended up using Friend against Red. Now, I only used Friend against the Pikachu. I only used it against the Pikachu because after Pikachu, he sent out Blastoise, and I was like, you know, we're not going to outspeed this Blastoise. I switched out. So I only used Friend against one Pokemon. With that being said, though, because I used a dead Pokemon, I knew that the comment section would have my neck for using that one dead Pokemon, and it would be considered cheating. So I decided to re-record. With that being said, you can't battle red again unless you you can't battle red again unless you beat the elite four again. So this that spoils that I beat red. But when I went back to battle him again, he wasn't there. The only way you can get him to spawn is beating the elite four. So I had to go through the elite four a third time just so I can get back to where I'm supposed to be so I can battle red. So I had to do all of this stuff just to get back here and I, I, I messed up you guys that, that's, that's all I can really say I just messed up big time so I battled red I know what his team is his team did not change from the game at all. his team his team is the same as what it was before the levels and the move sets are a bit different though that's the only thing about it but his team is the same so you know you got the Pikachu this uh, the cancel starters Snorlax and then um you know espion that's like his normal team or whatever so yeah there's that but i i feel really bad I, like this episode does it's a it's the finale and it doesn't even feel genuine like the first time the first time you know it was a good episode it was a really good episode but because i know how people are on youtube if you break even one rule of the nuzlocke 
they will take your neck so i decided to re-record i tried re-recording i went to mount moon he wasn't there so i had to rebound elite four and now we're back here but anyways i still do hope you guys enjoy this video um all of our pokemon are level 90 um I got Raichu now, I have Arcanine now because I just feel like they were the best ones to take on the team. Um, you know, yeah, so <laughs> there's that. Honestly, when if Ampharos had died, which Ampharos did die, you know, I was going to take the Raichu anyway because I feel like Raichu is just a little bit better than uh, Electivire because I think Electivire is part fighting in this game. It might be, it might not be, I'm not sure. And, um, you know, it's it's a special attacker as well so it's like it's not like i'm gonna be replacing a special attacker with a physical attacker you know i, don't, I just don't want to do that now i did that with nine tails because there was really no other fire types i wanted to take because every other fire type i had in the pc had they either it was like quad weak to water which we are or it was just like it had a it had a fighting type you know associated with it so then that's an extra flying weakness that i didn't want in the team so i just wanted another pure fighting uh fire type my bad fire type and that's where arcanine comes in so uh you know we have this thing here um katrina the raichu with uh volt switch thunder pedal dance nasty plot holding a wide lens because you know thunder is only 80 accuracy so uh there's that but i i genuinely feel bad you guys i i feel very bad i feel really bad that um i i just screwed up i screwed up i even went i also have the encounters um i also i also have the encounters see we can fly to mount moon i am so damn disappointed in myself dang dang jay how could you just mess it up that bad how did i mess it up that bad because like okay because i recorded the episode i finished the episode and i was like yo this is a good episode and then i go to edit and i see two spots missing from the party and i was like oh oh no who else died friend and i was like did i use friend in the battle i did and so because i used friend i had to redo it <laughs> even though i used friend on one pokemon and one pokemon only i had to I have to redo the episode see um let's see because see is like the bar part fighting in its game yeah it's part fighting in this game so i didn't want I, I didn't want i just didn't want to use it um i love electivire believe me i love electivire but you know again fighting type so i didn't want to have another fighting type on the team so you know there's that um and then you know they have fighting associated with them as well and then camera up i mean camera up is all right but in quad week to water but the uh the last two hatches or the last little well there's supposed to be three hatches but i missed my mount silver cave encounter so um tit duck was one of them and then the other was uh the vulpix here so i ah, just dang man i just messed up so freaking bad i messed up so bad so bad oh i messed up so bad how much money do we even have anyway how much money do we have how much money do we have i am going to go buy me some items uh, actually i'm gonna go buy some items um might as well go to blackthorn right it's right there so let's do it anyways so it doesn't feel genuine but you know hey you know what though anything could happen anything could happen because i want you to know when i battle red the first time i didn't lose a single pokemon in this one i might lose three you know you never know you never know critical hits are a thing you know crits just they're always a thing so man we are rich bro we are rich we are rich like look at this so much money anyways anyways um let's go ahead and go back to mount silver and let's take on red hopefully red is there red should be there because we beat the elite four again you know i was like yo how do you respawn red i was like oh my gosh did i mess it up do i have to use the bad recording luckily i don't luckily i don't so you know i'm not about to get roasted in the comment section well i'm probably gonna get roasted in the comment section anyway for messing up so bad like oh my gosh it's one of those things where it's like I didn't use a save state either like normally I would save state I didn't save state I should have save stated but I didn't save state I because like save states mess up in this game like all the time you know so I was just like whoops <laughs> but I should have save stated next time I'm definitely going to save state because I, I it just it just works it helps it helps so much you know so if you mess up you can just go back in time you know but <laughs> uh well at least i know i know to do that for like any other future series you know what i mean so but i don't know this game has like so many glitches with it 
So that's why I was just avoiding save states altogether. But, you know, yeah, I shouldn't have avoided. <laughs> I shouldn't have avoided the save state, though. My gosh, man, I can't believe I did that. Like, I, I, dang, Jay. How? How do you mess up that bad? Like, that is just, that's wild, right? Like, that's wild, that's, that's actually ri ridiculous. I don't know why I got on my bike, it's gonna take me off my bike and it won't let me get on my bike. So, rip the dream, rip the dream. Okay, okay, but anyways, so let's go up this rock wall here. Mm, excuse me, then here, then here. And then we go over. <laughs> oh man, the one thing about this game though, they make you travel the red. Like in the original Golden and Silver, you just go into the cave and he's like right there, you know? Here they make you travel. And there he is. All right, good. He respawned. Woo! <sighs> Let's do it. Let's do it. It's time. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Ah, let's do it. Ah, ooh, he, hey, hey, level 100. So, I'm under level. Yay! But yeah, we were under level the first time though, so it just makes it more challenging. And at the same time, I didn't know he was gonna be level 100, but you know, whatever. Anyways, nasty plot. Because this Pikachu cannot do anything to us. This Pikachu can't do anything to us. What? Huh? Wait, 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 whoa, 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 hold the phone, hold the phone. We have lightning rod. Wait, did it change what lightning rod duck? Oh, you're kidding me, bro. Hold on. Okay, Google. Pokemon lightning rod. You're kidding me. Don't tell me they changed. They actually changed what it does, right? Um. Oh, it got immunity in Gen 5. Uh, that's trash, bro. That is trash, bro. That's ass. Whatever, man. Whatever. I thought we were given I thought we were gonna be getting immunity, dude. I thought we were being given the immunity. It doesn't matter, we oh, oh. You're kidding me, right? Oh my gosh, why? What's the point? <laughs> why? And I now I have to switch because I'm parallel oh my gosh. See, in the first battle, this didn't happen. Ephros bodied the Pikachu, because we tail glowed. I mean, we still bodied the Pikachu, but we're paralyzed. Oh my gosh, we're paralyzed now. Now we gotta go into Empoleon. This, but this is how I fought the Blastoise, though, because Ampharos doesn't outspeed Blastoise, and we're weak to electric, so. Okay. I'm, I'm, I am 100% though, upset though. Yes, I'm very upset. Uh, what do we need to do? Status healer. Zoom. All right, let's get it. Flash cannon. That's neutral, but it shouldn't kill. It's not stab. I always say that if it's not stab, it doesn't kill. You know, unless you're like quad weak to it, then it has a chance to kill. But if it's like if it's like if it does neutral damage and it's not stab, it's not killing. Unless you're at a range where it will kill. But you know, yeah. Anyways, anyways. Oh my gosh, I can't I can't believe I messed up so bad. <laughs> I messed up so bad. <laughs> I messed up so bad. Like, that's wild. That's crazy. That's ridiculous. Lower that speed. Lower that speed. Lower that speed. Lower that speed. Alright. Yeah, let's try to get a burn. Let's get a burn. We outspeed this thing now too. That's crazy. Let's get a burn. Burn, 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 burn. 
Yeah, we got the burn. Okay. <laughs> I am. I am a character. <laughs> oh my. I am too silly. I am too silly. I am too silly, 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 All right, let's go. Ah, oh, he's gonna heal. Darn it, he's gonna heal. He's gonna heal. He's at a, he's at a range of HP where he is going to heal. Well, he's gonna be at a range of HP where he's gonna heal, which means we should just go into Raichu, right? I think we should go into Raichu. Let's go into the Raichu. Let's go into the Raichu. Oh yeah, he's definitely healing. This is Raichu all day. Do you think a Thunder will KO this thing? Do you think a Thunder will KO? I hope, I think a Thunder will KO. It's super effective, right? Yeah, it's super effective. Yeah, this Blastoise is about to die. This thing is about to die. 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 Cause we won't take we won't take a water move. We will not take a water move at all. So we have to kill with this thunder. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can kill. You can Oh my gosh! How did you live that? Bro! Oh, we're done. Well, bye Raichu. We're done. We're done. I should've just stayed in with Napoleon. I should've just stayed in with Napoleon. I should've just stayed in. Well, Raichu's dead. What the heck? How did you live a thunder? I mean, I understand you're bulky, but jeez, dude, I should have volt switched. I should have volt switched, da -da -da -da. but I didn't volt switch, da -da -da -da. and now I'm suffering. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> I'm suffering because of it. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> <laughs> we just got the right to. I should have just stayed with the first recording. At least we didn't lose a Pokemon in that battle. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't believe this. I cannot believe this. Blastoise lived. It lived. It lived a thunder. Gosh, man. Ridiculous. I mean, we're, we're 10 levels under, but dang, man. Like, dang, it was in the yellow. I would have expected at least in the red, but in the yellow? That's wild. That is wild. Okay, so. We ended up with the death anyway. Shoot, dang! How did we end up with the death? We shouldn't have even ended up with the death. We shouldn't have done it. I would have gone into Arcanine there, but the rain is up, so Flare Blitz won't be doing much damage. And there is a good possibility this Venusaur would have Earthquake because this is playing off of Driano. Driano makes sure that he has coverage on the Mons, so the Venusaur doesn't get anything that can take out a Salamence outside of HP Ice. But I'm D dancing. I'm D dancing and I am killing you now. It's time. Poison? What? Isn't that gunk shot? Oh, poison storm. Oh, please live. Oh, please live. Please live. Please live. What? 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 Oh my gosh! What? That did so much damage! That did so much damage, okay? Because look, I'm gonna go ahead and say it. This Venusaur, when I faced it the first time, he swords danced. It swords danced on me. It did not go for Poison Storm. I didn't even know it had that. All right, shoot. There's the swords dance. You. <sighs> okay, whatever. Fine. Fly. Phew! It's time to body this Venusaur. Okay, it's doing, now it's doing, okay. Don't miss the fly. Don't miss the fly. Do not miss the fly. Yes! Now. Die, 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 yeah! I mean, we're plus one Salamence. We're gonna sweep the rest of the team. It's over. Charizard, we have Dragon Rush. It's time. You're dead. Goodbye, Charizard. It does not matter. 
See you later. Super affected. Boom. Goodbye. You're dead. You suck. Actually, you don't really suck. But still, you're dead. Goodbye. See you later. All right. And uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, ha. Oh, ha. Hey, ha. Oh, ha. Hey. <laughs> I have accepted the fact that I am indeed a weirdo. <laughs> Woo! We're weird! Espeon! <laughs> oh, we missed! Oh, that drag- Oh, that reflect actually just made a difference. That reflect just made a huge difference. Now it's gonna take probably two dragon rushes to kill this thing. <sighs> what? What? Oh no 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 no! Do you think it will kill? Oh oh my gosh! Ah! We're living! Oh my gosh! Let's go. Goodbye. Get out of here. Get out of my face, idiot. Woo! Woo! Oh man! <laughs> oh gosh, I am so silly. <laughs> All right, Willowis. Bra! Now you are burned. Now you would not be doing any damage to me. Body slam does not matter to me. Dang, that still did quite a bit of damage. It's like 25%? Yeah, it's like roughly 25%, bro. That's crazy. That is crazy. Alright, drain punch. Oh, the f The fuck? Fuck, man. How are you gonna miss drain punch? Man, that's dumb. That's dumb. That is dumb. Can the reflect wear off, please? Doesn't wear off. We missed the drain punch. Oh my gosh. Another thing I don't like about this game. They lower the accuracy of all the moves for no reason. Jeez. My goodness. But why isn't your body slam missing? Ah, oh, here we go. All right, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh my gosh. Oh, um, why would you do this to me? Just heal. Oh, your resto chesto. Oh my. Come on now. You better hope I don't get a crit. If I get a crit, you're dead. You're a dead Dunzo Ripperoni. Ripperoni? Yeah, Ripperoni. We didn't even put it to the yellow. Jeez. That reflect came through, bro. That 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 Espeon literally made the battle that much more difficult. It made it that much more difficult. The first time, it wasn't this difficult. Really? Really? Like no, really? Like you're you're serious, right? I just lost two Pokemon in a battle when I didn't even lose what? The first battle, I didn't even lose a single Mon. Now I'm losing two? That's dumb. The first battle, I didn't even lose a Mon. Now I'm losing, I lost two. Now I have to do editing. Oh my. Okay. You, you gotta go. You got to go. All right, you gotta go. If you don't stop paralyzing me! Thank you. Shoot, I I'm gonna paralyze you. Let's go. Let's go. Get paralyzed. That's what I'm talking about. Get full para. Oh no. Alright, this Snorlax is actually being a pain in my butt right now. Power punch. Raise my attack. Power punch. Raise my attack again. Alright. One more power punch. Goodbye. Stupid. Ugh. There, we beat him. Again. We beat him again.
<sighs> but we lost two Pokemon this time. How? Oh my. Critical hits suck. Critical hits suck so much. Oh well. Oh well. Like I said, first time we didn't lose any mons. This time we lost two. So it is what it is. But anyways, that is it for the series, you guys. The finale, it's done. The series is over. It's actually kind of crazy. You know, like I myself didn't really enjoy the game because there were things in the game that just didn't make sense to me. For example, the type chart. The type chart is like the biggest thing that didn't make any sense to me. And then they started adjusting, um, you know, accuracy of moves. They, they, they gave accuracy to like low accuracy moves, but then high accuracy moves, they lowered the accuracy of those moves. And it's like, it's like, why, man? In Pokemon, 95 accuracy doesn't mean 100 because that 5% miss sucks i've seen it happen i've seen it happen like in a ucl battle where a five percent miss costs someone a game okay like legit it it sucks don't make things 95 accuracy if they had 100 accuracy beforehand that is bad anyways you know outside of that though i mean i love gen 2 so it's one of those things where it's like i could still play this game over and over and over again because it's generation 2 because i love gen 2 but um but yeah anyways stream tomorrow 3 p.m est on youtube i will be hatching the eggs monday there will be a death montage tuesday there will be a review wednesday there will be an update thursday i don't know probably some sort of random pokemon quiz and then friday probably some sort of sun and moon video talking about what kind of team i'm gonna be having in sun and moon i don't know something like that maybe i'm not sure but yeah the series is over though i mean i'm glad you guys enjoy you know my frustration through this game i'm glad you guys enjoy the lp overall you guys are probably wondering what the next lp is gonna be it is gonna be uranium because i really want to play pokemon uranium it's finally finished and it has new pokemon in it so i was like you know what let's play it so we're gonna be doing that for the next lp but I hope you guys enjoyed this Let's Play. If you guys did, don't forget to hit the like button down below to show your support. Again, I truly apologize for having to re-record this episode because, you know, I messed up in the first recording. But, you know, please forgive me. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. But again, hit the like button if you enjoy. Let's see if we can reach 300 likes for the finale of this Let's Play um don't forget to answer the comment question of the day down in the comment section below and if you enjoy the content here on the channel don't forget to hit the subscribe button as well but i'm gonna go ahead and get up out of here thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys next time peace